Price represents the quantity of money received by the firm or the seller for its products. From a customer's point of view, it represents a monetary sacrifice. Hence, price represents the perception of the value of the product. Price is equal to quantity of money received by the seller divided by quantity of goods and services received by the buyer. How the price has been decided? Price decision framework. Factors affecting price decisions are the corporate or the organization, organization's policies, and the top management's intention. Second point, cost cost of production and different other costs involved in the production process. Third is demand, demand of the product in the market, likely demand or maybe future demands can be considered for this. Government policies, sometimes government used to change the policies, it also directly affects the pricing strategy of the product. Then companies reactions to the competitors pricing strategy. Sometimes competitors do affect us a lot. They change the price, they change the pricing strategy and that's why we have to be reactive also. And sometimes there are some competitors, they try to surprise us by following a different type of pricing strategy. And the last point is barriers in the industry like technology. Technology is another factor which also affects the pricing decision framework. Customer perception and customer psychology do also affect pricing strategies. Apart from customer, economic conditions do affect pricing strategy. Family circumstances or household circumstances, which we consider as consumption, area of consumption, do also, also affect pricing strategy. Disposable income of your customer also affect pricing. Purpose of the product in the market or the need of the product in the market do also affect pricing strategy. And sometimes the occasion of purchase, why you are purchasing, what is the requirement of the product in that occasion do also affect the pricing strategy. What are the pricing objectives? Pricing objectives are followed by the company and these are some of the reasons for which company used to follow a typical pricing strategy. A company can pursue some of the major objectives through pricing. First is survival. This is a short term objective that is appropriate only for companies that are plagued with overcapacity, intense competition and uh, maybe a changing customer demands. As long as price covers the variable cost, some of the fixed costs, uh, then the company is very much interested to remain in the business. Second objective of pricing is maximum current profit. To maximize the current profit, organizations or companies, they estimate the demand and cost associated with alternative price and then choose the price that produces the maximum current profit, cash flow and uh, return on investment. However, by emphasizing current profits, the company may sacrifice long-term performance by ignoring effects of uh, other marketing mix, competitors' reaction, and uh, legal restraints on pricing. Third objective of pricing is maximum market share. Where the firms believe that higher sales volume will lead to lower unit cost and higher long-term profit. With this market penetration strategy has been followed, the firm sets a lower price and assume that the market price is going to be sensitive. This is appropriate when the market is highly price sensitive. So a low pricing strategy, low pricing strategy will stimulate the market growth. Then another objective of pricing is maximizing market skimming. So many companies, they favor setting a very high price to scheme the market. The objective is to ensure higher profit first, then gradually they try to reduce the price. So in this process, a marketer need to have a sufficient number of buyers, those who have high demand. Then you need cost need to be identified so that uh, high price may not be affecting 
more and the high initial price doesn't or should not affect maximum competitors activities in this process only we can follow the maximum market scheming we understood what is price and what are the pricing objectives